the topic of pneumothorax has been discussed twice but this is such a nice x-ray that I thought I should discuss it with you guys uh, the more x-rays you see more experienced you become and in order to become good at diagnosis you need to see quite a few every day practice makes the man perfect so this is another example of uh, pneumothorax you can see right collapsed lung in this area you can see air density beyond uh, visceral pleura visceral pleura should not be visible on uh, normal chest x-ray and the reason why I believe that this is a collapsed lung and this is a pneumothorax because you cannot see vascular markings beyond this line another reason for us to believe that this is a pneumothorax you have pencil sharp margins of the right hemidiaphragm and the air density is going too far down a normal hemidiaphragm should not be that steep it should not make such an acute angle moreover I believe that this is a supine x-ray. The x-ray does not mention whether it's a supine or erect. And the only reason I believe that this is a supine x-ray because of this sharp shadow that is going too far deep. If you are suspecting a small pneumothorax, this is quite big, and the x-ray was taken in erect position, you look for the pneumothorax in this area apex. And if you are looking for a small pneumothorax and the x-ray was taken in supine position you look for the pneumothorax in this area because in supine position this is the highest point uh, and in erect position this is the highest point air rises up the rest of the tissues are heavier than the air and if the patient was x-rayed in supine position this is the best place to look for the pneumothorax if the patient was x-rayed in erect position this is the place to look for the pneumothorax you can see that right uh, hard border is not visible only because the lung is collapsed there is no air within lung the air is leaking out of the lung and because heart and collapsed lung have very similar densities now so the counter the border of the heart is not visible anymore you can see left heart border clearly visible because one side of the line you have a dense tissue and the other side you have lung that is mostly filled with air this is a discoided lactasis uh, and probably patient has a small pleural effusion another way you can try to to guess whether the x-ray was uh, erect or supine this is air bubble in the stomach and it should normally uh, make a straight fluid level in erect position a uh, few other things when you have uh, a pneumothorax also look for the and you have no history available as we don't have any history available uh, for this patient also look for the signs of trauma look for the rib fractures because one of the main causes of pneumothorax uh, can be a traumatic injury so the quality that is visible to me I cannot see any rib fractures on, but I can see a surgical suture here in the neck and I can also see air density within the soft tissue around neck which is surgical emphysema and if you go inferiorly and try and change your window level settings you can see some sutures here metallic sutures and this is a post-op patient the pneumothorax is tension pneumothorax because it is shifting the mediastinum towards the left hand side all the mediastinal structures you can see have been shifted towards the left hand side it becomes life threatening as it uh, compresses the major blood vessels and compromises the blood supply they need to put in a chest tube urgently and try to remove this air from the right pleural cavity so lung can expand again and it can start functioning once again keep 
this shape in mind and I'll show you a normal chest x-ray in a minute so you can differentiate how a normal hemidiaphragm should look like as compared to this one our normal chest x-ray and you can clearly see the right hemidiaphragm uh, this is the normal shape of the hemidiaphragm the air density is not going too far deep and the although the diaphragm has a sharp margin but it's not as sharp as the and the uh, the costophenic angle and cardio diaphragmatic angle here you can see right hard border left hard border clearly and thank you very much